Welcome learners to Form 2 Mathematics. We are going to look at trigonometry 1 problems. Trigonometry 1 problems. Uh, let us look at this example. You are told that given that sine theta is 3 over 5, sine theta is 3 over 5, find without using mathematical tables or calculators the following. Cos theta, tan theta, sin, sin 90 minus theta, cos 90 minus theta, add tan 90 minus theta. Learn. If you are told to solve this problem without using mathematical tables or calculators, what do we use? We use a right angled triangle. A right angled triangle. And you say, let this be my theta, angle theta which is an acute angle there. So, learn. You have learned about what we call soccer toa. Soccer toa. Soccer toa. It helps us to remember about what sine theta, tan theta, and cos theta are, or how you find them. So, sine theta is equal to opposite of hypotenuse. Cos is equal to adjacent over hypotenuse. And tan theta is equal to opposite over adjacent. Therefore, learn. If you fix your theta here, this side which is opposite this angle, this side which is opposite this angle is called the opposite. And this other one here is called the adjacent. And so from there, this is the hypotenuse, hypotenuse. So in reference to this theta, this is opposite, you know, it is directly opposite at the angle. This is adjacent and obviously that is the hypotenuse. So what are we told here? We are told that sine theta is 3 over 5. Sine theta is 3 over 5. Is 3 over 5. It means that this is the opposite. You, you see, sine is equal to opposite of hypotenuse. This is the opposite and this is the hypotenuse. You come and fix them here. If this is theta, the opposite is 3 and the hypotenuse is 5. From the alana, you look for this side. Work out this side here. Call it x. Call it x. So using Pythagoras theorem, x squared plus 3 squared lana is equals to 5 squared. So x squared plus 9 is equals to 25. x squared lana is 25 minus 9. x squared is equals to 16. And therefore you find square root and you find that this side here is 4 centimeters. So here you have 4. That side is 4. So from there, Lana, you are now told find cos A. So A, what is cos A? What is cos A? And not cos A, sorry, cos theta. What is cos theta? Cos theta, Lana, is equal to adjacent of a hypotenuse. Cos of this theta here is equal to adjacent of a hypotenuse. And therefore, the answer is 4 over 5 adjacent of hypotenuse. We go to B. What is tan theta? Tan theta lana is equals to what? Tan theta is equals to opposite over adjacent. Opposite over adjacent. Tan theta is equals to opposite over adjacent and therefore tan of this theta here is equals to opposite over adjacent which is 3 over 4. We go to C lana. We go to C. Go to C. Go to C. You are told that. You are told that. Find sine 90 minus theta. Find sine that 90 minus theta. How do you find it, this lana? Where is this angle 90 minus theta? Where is this angle 90 minus theta? Lana. You come to your triangle. We know that the interior angles of a triangle, the interior angles of a triangle add up to 180. These three angles here add up to 180. So, Lana, in a right angled triangle where this is already 90 degrees, 
in a right angled triangle where this is 90 degrees, then it means that these two acute angles here add up to, uh, add up to 90 degrees. I repeat, angles in a triangle add up to 180. In a right angled triangle, this is already 90. So 180 minus 90, it means that the answer will be 90. So these two acute angles add up to 90. And so Lana, if this is theta, therefore, it means that this angle here will be 90 minus theta, 90 degrees minus theta. These two add up to 90 degrees. So if this is theta, this is 90 minus theta. And so with this learner, what is sine 90 minus theta? In this case, sine 90 minus theta will be equal to opposite. This now becomes your opposite. Opposite, opposite of hypotenuse. So this gives you 4 over 5. We go to D. What is cos 90 degrees minus theta? cos of this angle here. The cos of this angle here is equal to what? Adjacent. This is now the adjacent. Adjacent over hypotenuse. This is the adjacent of this angle. So cos 90 minus theta is equal to adjacent, which is 3, over hypotenuse, which is 5. And similarly, tan 90 degrees, 90 degrees, sorry, minus theta will be equal to what? Tan theta is equal to opposite of adjacent. So tan 90 minus theta will be equal to opposite, you see, opposite, which is 4, over adjacent, which is 3, which is 3. So learn, go and practice on such problems to do the trigonometry. Remember, these two acute angles in a right angle triangle add up to 90 degrees. You have to be able to fix this go here, which is 90 minus theta degrees. All the best, learners. All the best.